Hey guys, I got a new video for you today and I wanted to talk about the sprinkles or sprinkle donuts or donut philosophy when it comes to EDC items. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, that is basically a, um, a line of uh, different EDC tools that follow a particular theme, and in this case being the sprinkles or sprinkle donuts or donut theme. It's got a, a couple different names. Now, in the EDC community, um, primarily the folks that carry like flashlights and knives and tools and stuff like that, there are um, a lot of times when the folks try to uh, follow a particular um, theme a lot of it being centered around the same material or the same look for those particular items, uh, whether it be you know same material meaning like all titanium, same look meaning like an all blacked out EDC, uh, and so forth and so on. You know other materials like copper and brass and things like that uh, obviously come into play as well. Now one of those themes is the sprinkles or sprinkle donut or the donut theme, and I have a little bit of a kit right here that kind of follows that theme to go ahead and show you guys and I have a new item that I'm going to be adding to this particular themed loadout. So this is a small little Viperate pouch um, that I have here. It's really cool. It's got a, uh, a little uh, Velcro loop field in the back and I have a, a patch there and inside of here I have three items that follow that theme. The first one is this one here. This is a Swiss Army knife. Um, and it's got these sprinkled um, theme. So you see here, it's like a pink background with sprinkles on it. It's a sprinkled donut theme. Again, it has a bunch of different names. This is actually a Blade HQ exclusive one. So um, I am a big fan of um, Swiss Army knives. I always try and carry one with me because of all the tools. They're very useful, especially the scissors and um, the pen blade. Uh, this one has the um, screwdriver in the back. So um, you know, when this came um, up for, when it became available on Blade HQ, I went ahead and picked it up. At the same time, um, I'm a big fan of Olights, and they, not too long ago, came out with their own version of the sprinkles as well. Uh, this is an Olight, this one being the i3T EOS. This is the one that runs on one AAA. Great EDC flashlight, very small, very compact. Uh, you have two different modes. I believe the maximum output on the higher mode is 180 lumens, which is perfect. But again, I picked it up because it does ca carry on that sprinkle theme. With this one, one really cool thing is that the actual sprinkles are etched and colored into the aluminum body. So um, it's not just painted on there, they're actually etched in there. So the little holes are etched in there and then they're filled into the different colors. And then the last item is actually back here. This is uh, also a um, tool from Olight. Uh, this is, or O-Knife in this case. This is the Night Claw. Now, um, the Night Claw was originally released in two different colors, blue and uh, like a khaki color. But they came out with these scales. So if you had a Night Claw, you can go ahead and replace the scales. And then again, it follows that kind of um, sprinkle theme. Uh, this has a little button in the middle there, which is a little jewel also. And if you press that, the claw comes out. Again, this is a little D2 uh, kind of claw, claw blade from O-Knife. And uh, again, it's called the Night Claw. And um, I like the, uh, that you were able to get the option to swap the scales out for the uh, sprinkled so it can kind of follow that same theme. Obviously, as you guys can see here, um, even though pink and sprinkled is the theme of this, there are a couple of different shades and stuff like that. But, you know, again, it kind of matches that whole thing. So um, in comes this guy here. So even though I do have a Swiss Army knife, I always like to carry an actual knife. And I was looking for one to kind of add to this, uh, this little loadout here. And I was able to pick up this guy here. This is from Civivi and this is the Elementum. This particular model is the C907A-2 pink G10 handle with printed sprinkled pattern and a blue painted D2 blade. So obviously you can tell by the description that it is going to definitely match this loadout very, very nicely. So as also DVs that do come in these little pouches, which is really nice. Inside you do have a couple different things, obviously the knife, which will set off to the side. And then you have a sticker, um, this other little sticker here. 
the warranty information, and a cleaning cloth. So we'll set that off to the side, take a look at the knife itself. I'm not gonna spend too much time talking about the knife as far as uh, what it is. Uh, it's a Savivi Elementum. There's a ton of videos on YouTube regarding this knife. I just wanted to go ahead and show it to you guys because I was pretty happy to be able to pick this guy up. Um, I do have a couple other Elementums in my rotation, so I know um, this knife, and it's a staple from the CVV brand, but I love the um, you know the treatment that they did to it so again it's got the pink uh scales right here the liners are actually uh, kind of like a like a toast color i guess you could call it so that's really nice you have the two standoffs are actually two different colors and they do match the screws right here so you have a green one and a blue one the pivot screw on this side on the show side is got the Silivi logo but it is purple and then the pocket clip nice deep right clip uh, it is this kind of light blue color, and even the screws for the clip, I don't know if you guys can make those out, if I'm getting enough lighting in there, but one is purple and one is red. So there is a lot of color going on in this. You have a nice little lanyard hole in the back there. This is a flipper. So as you flip it out, you have that blue painted D2 blade. So really, really awesome. I think they went all out in this uh, in this particular knife to make it match the... Um, Again, the sprinkles or the donut or the donut sprinkle theme that, um, you know, obviously is pretty prevalent in a lot of folks' EDC. Uh, if you're in, into the EDC game and in the EDC community, you definitely know about this. So, um, you know, I just kind of wanted to get another piece to add on to my little loadout here of the sprinkle collection. Again, each and every one of these is a slightly different hue of that pink. I think the night claw and the Elementum here probably match the most, but this one is like a more pinkish pink versus this is a lighter pink. But it's uh, I, I was just really happy that I was able to find that guy to add it on to my collection. And I was going to go ahead and showcase it to you guys because I know a lot of folks really like to see, um, you know, these uh, themed EDC loadouts. Again, different colors, different materials and stuff like that. So this is one that uh, I was recently able to pick up and add it to that particular loadout. So I wanted to go ahead and show it to you guys. So there it is. Uh, just a quick look at the new Civivi Elementum in the uh, pink uh, spring collection here that I was able to add to my loadout. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.